looks like Mark Martin and Brian Vickers. Oh, Ryan man. Newman, hard to the outside wall. Tell me when you're done here, but that will bring the caution out. Hey, that's still going for a ride. Okay, okay, all good. We're going to need another car coming. Now, I was just about to mention, that's a big break for Mark shot. Martin and Brian Vickers because they were out in front of the leader, so they'll be back on the lead lap. I bet that's the first time Tony had ever heard that. Did we're you gonna... hear, Ryan, that Spotter calls to him, tell me when you can make me? He's up still wrecking? <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> Slow car just in front of Newman. That's the 57. Norm Benning. Oh, it looks like the double zero. David Rudeman looks just like gets Rudeman. into the back of him. Ryan came and dropped down to, uh, to the inside to get around uh, 57 of Norm Benning, and it uh, looked like David Rudeman, a double zero, got into him. Well, you Rudeman know, he was in the middle of the back straightaway where he got into the back of him. Rudeman had a run, and it looked like he was trying to bump draft Newman and give him a push down the straightaway. But the problem is, Ryan had just cleared the 57. He was sort of in that swinging motion where he hadn't gotten right, himself straightened back up. You're clear. All clear. Exactly. All clear. Keep coming. Green is still out. Green is still out. Hard That's lick. a hard lick. Boy, it really is. It's so unexpected. And, uh, of course, Norm Benning, normally slow cars are told to move to the inside. Uh, I guess he uh, they came up on him so fast, got him trapped out there, and he didn't. Uh, he couldn't do it. At least he held his line. Ryan is okay. And uh, I believe that was a hit into the concrete, not the safer bear. Yep. Yeah, he, I believe he hit the concrete in the back straight away. I'm not real sure if that's the way the... Yeah. What's up, dude? Yeah, David Rudman. Darrell, I think you, 